Harley, what happened to your eye? No. Oh my goodness. Come here, come here. No. I want to no. look at it. No. Can mommy look no. at it, please? No. I can't look at it. No. What happened? No. Hey Mountain Family, how's it going? So today it is raining as crap outside. It's been raining for like the past, I don't know, week straight here in West Virginia. It's been ridiculous. So because it's rainy and gloomy and the weekend just happened so my house is a little bit of a wreck, <laughs> I'm gonna clean some house today. And I guess we're just gonna kinda like relax here at the house. What are you doing? Mommy! Huh? Mommy! What? I got this. I love you too. <laughs> I think you just wanted to be on camera. Yeah. Yeah, you did? Yeah. She's doing that thing again. Oh, careful. Yeah. Careful. Are you going to pull yourself up? Are you going to do it? I might, Mommy. I might do it. You have two different boots on. Yeah. And they're both on the wrong feet. Yeah. Yeah. And they're not even your boots. <laughs> they're sissies. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> sissies. <laughs> You're obsessed with her boots lately? You might have we might have to get you some. Go on with your bad self. You can stand up. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. She's trying so hard. I show you guys this on camera because it was inappropriate, but <laughs> Kenley just informed me that she took off her diaper. I think that we're getting close to potty training because she does not want to wear it anymore. And she has some accidents. Yes, you're drinking your juice. But she really tries and she really wants to go potty on the potty. Don't you, Ken's? Yeah. Yes, you do. I went to go walk away to get my tripod to show you guys what happened to my tripod and yeah. someone got angry. Why are you so angry? What happened? Well, I found out what was wrong. And it wasn't a nap. <laughs> you can probably guess. I don't know how I'm going to film this because the girls decided to break both of my tripods. Yes, you and Sissy broke both of my tripods. Yeah. Both of them. Yeah. Yeah. I haven't even had them that long, and they're already broken because my girls just like to get into everything. So, Daddy's not too happy that he has to buy me new tripods. This is what happens every time I go to do dishes, huh? Anytime I do dishes. Something has to be destroyed or wrecked or dirtied or <laughs> something. <laughs> it's always something. When Carly's here, though, it's way worse than just this. This is just shoes. I can clean shoes. Carly breaks something or destroys something. I see that. Yeah. Your phone? Your phone? What's wrong? I think I know what's wrong. I do think I know what it is. It's nap time, finally. Yes. It is. Oh, 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 look what you just did! You just stood up! Yay! You just stood up! Andy! I'm so happy for you! She's been getting up on her knees for the past couple weeks. She'll get up on her knees. But this is the first time you actually stood up! Aw, oh, Sissy! That's so great! Yeah. It's and now it's time for a nap, right? Now it is. Look at Kenley. Kenley. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So while I put Andy down and while she's getting all calmed for bed, let me just show you guys like what we're doing with this room real quick. This dresser broke not long ago, and as soon as it broke, we were like, okay, we have to replace it really fast because this setup is not the best. <laughs> we have the pack and play right here, so it doesn't fall, but it still needs to get out of here like today. We ordered this as like a temporary dresser. It's got all these cubbies and cub cubicles and like there's a cubicle to store whatever, but then it has like this long section right here right there to like hang stuff and it goes all the way down are you kidding me is that diablo sauce in my cu cubicle 
Oh my God, it is. Oh, my children. Anyway, so there's this one to hang stuff. There is this one to hang stuff. And the rest are just cubicles all the way down like this. Probably won't use these bottom ones because the girls will. Is that more Diablo sauce? Oh my gosh. What is up with my children in Diablo sauce? So this is temporary. We want to get an actual dresser later on. My plan today is to move this thing out of here. Devin's going to fix the back of it because that's what happened. The back of it is broken. So Devin's going to fix it and he's going to use it for himself. And this needs to come out of here. Actually, it needs thrown away because it's gross. Like, look how disgusting it is now because it's been through three children. So it really actually needs thrown out. That's disgusting. <laughs> This needs thrown out. I'm basically going to spring clean this whole room pretty soon because it needs it. And we need to do like a Christmas clean out. And I kind of want to do it in November instead of waiting for December. Why not just do it now? So I might do that later on. What? You need to, go, you need to take a nap too? Oh, your diaper? Yeah. Well, okay then. So before I do some laundry and basically do some more chores before Carly comes home because <laughs> it's kind of hard to do chores when she's here because she's like a tornado. Um, I thought I would just pause for a second and let you guys know that I am doing a Q&A. Some of you guys like already know this, but I'm doing a Q&A about my adopted daughter Grace tomorrow. I'm going to actually film it today. Actually, I'm going to film it tonight, edit it tomorrow, and it'll be up on Thursday. Wednesday. When I told my original story, I left out a lot of nitty gritty details because if I would have told the entire story in all of its detail, it would have been like uh, maybe 30 minutes long. It would have been a very long vlog. I was just trying to give like the basic details and the basic concept of what happened and I was just trying to like effectively tell my story without it being so long that no one wants to watch it because if you make a vlog too long no one's going to watch it apparently that vlog the celebrating my adopted daughter's birthday vlog has really affected my channel because my growth has like stopped <laughs> it went from being good and okay it was steady and all right we're getting somewhere to nothing I don't know I just feel like I'm getting judged for something that was totally out of my control I didn't ask to get postpartum depression I didn't ask for our bonding time to be disrupted I didn't ask for me to miss out. <laughs> Sorry. I just didn't ask for that whole situation to happen the way it did. When I was pregnant with her, that was not my plan. That was not my goal. And I was so young, and she was my first baby, and I was so naive. I didn't know what postpartum depression was. I thought I was just going crazy. And before you watch my Q&A, just know guys that I did the best that I could. I wanted to do what was best for her. Not what was best for me and my image and what makes me look good and what society expected of me. I would have what was best for her. Was it best for her to stay with the people that she already bonded to, that she already saw as parents, that she already loved and accepted and wanted? Or was it better for her to be in a relationship and in a situation with a parent who didn't get to have that bonding time, who would then have to find some way to create that bond? When she was like 18 months old, she was almost two years old you guys and I still had postpartum depression I mean which one is better for her you choose you tell me then and I could just and I just never could figure out how to fix it the whole 18 months that I was there I just didn't know how to fix it and I tried I tried so hard I just know that I'm not a bad person. Just because I miss her and love her like I do one of my sisters doesn't mean that it's a bad love. People hear the word different and they associate it with bad. It's not bad. It's just different because the situation I was in and the depression that I was feeling and because our bonding time got disrupted, it just turned into a sisterly love. And I'm going to go into this. I feel like I'm already trying to go into the Q&A. Okay, so now that I have effectively got all up in my emotions today, I need to get some laundry done. A 
oh crap, Carly's about to come home from school like any second. I didn't realize how late it was. Carly, what happened to your eye? No. Oh my goodness. Come here, come here. I want to no. look at it. No. Can mommy look no. at it, please? No. I can't look at it? No. What happened? No. No? You're not going to tell mommy? <coughs> You don't want to tell mommy what happened? No. Did you did you knock no. into somebody? Okay. Your teacher told me you knocked into somebody. No. Yes, she did. No. Carly. No. Does it hurt? No. You just want to say no? Yeah. Do you want a tissue? Because you're running your nose. Oh, Carly. Honey, that looks bad. Oh, honey. Apparently, she does not want to talk about it, but she's got a big old black eye now. Apparently, she like ran into one of her classmates and hit that bone right there and got a black eye. She said it was an accident, but God, it looks bad, doesn't it? I feel bad for her, really bad. Are you feeling much happier? No. No, your eye hurts? Yeah. Well, at least you're not mad at me anymore. Good morning, sunshine. You do know it's like five o'clock, right? And you're still asleep? Yeah. You need a light on so you can get up or you're never gonna sleep tonight. Wakey, wakey. Oh, oh my gosh. Look at you. She's gonna fall. She is going to fall. Oh, don't fall, Miss Andy. She's chewing on the chair. She's chewing. <laughs> Are you chewing on the chair? Uh oh, uh oh. She's gonna fall. Carly, 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 honey. She's gonna fall if you do that. Don't make her fall. I'm surprised she kept her balance. There you go, use that one. So I guess this is what we're doing for the rest of the evening. We're gonna watch TV. It is? Thank you, Ken's, for telling me that. We're just gonna sit here for the rest of the day. And you want to watch? Okay, you can watch it. If you have any leftover questions about Grace and that whole situation, just leave me a comment down below and I will answer it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to follow me on social media, the links are down below. And I'll see you guys later in a new vlog. Bye guys.